So today I'm going to do a review on the Aveeno Active Natural Clear Complexion Daily Cleansing Pads and it looks just like this. Okay, look just like this. Very nice, very nice. So I saw these pads at Walmart in the skincare aisle and I've been searching for a good skincare product that I can afford that will help reduce my acne my pores breakouts all that good stuff so and i'm still looking out for a new product so if you know a good product that does not dry your skin out peel your skin out and does not make you break out even worse Leave that product down below so i can check it out but anyway so and make sure it's not too expensive because I'm a college student, I ain't got no money. Anyway, so um, I'm going to give you my thoughts on this product right here. Um, I have been using this, okay, it is February right now. So I've been using this for a good, for a good month because I started using this um, before my birthday. My birthday is January 20th. So I've been using this before then. Um, we're going to go with the cons first about this product, okay? But first, this product is supposed to help prevent breakouts and gently exfoliate for clear, even-looking skin. And it has soy extracts in it. So, this right here contains salic acid and it's 0.5%. Um, salic acid is very good if you have acne-prone skin. Um, let's see what else it says. Directions, so you gently massage product all over your face, avoiding the eye area. Rinse face thoroughly after use. Um, what else that I need to say? Okay, so these pads are designed to help clear up and prevent breakouts to leave your skin clear, smooth, and even looking. These dual texture cleansing pads are pre moistened with a blemish fighting ingredient and soy to improve skin clarity and even out skin tone and texture. But not over dry your skin. The pad is textured on one side to gently exfoliate smooth on the other side to lift away dirt and oil and makeup. That can clog pores and cause breakouts. Gently enough for everyday use in for um, sensitive skin. Okay, so that's the reason why I picked up this product. And I did watch some reviews before I purchased this product and a lot of them liked it. They didn't have acne worse like mine, but you know, they had a little spit here and there. Here's my notes, so I won't you know, leave out anything. The cons about this product that I do not like is that it dries out your skin horribly. You can, you can actually feel the roughness of your skin. You can actually kind of see it. Um, it kind of looks like your skin has been burned. It makes my dark spots even worse. It makes my skin very dry and peeling, and I do not like that. Um, what else? Yes, it does make your skin ashy. It makes your skin rough. It causes hyperpigmentation, and it makes it itchy. And it leaves this burning feeling. I'm okay with that, but it's been, like, burning like crazy. And I like salic acid, but this right here is irritating the mess out of my skin. Now, the pros about this product is that it leaves a clean feel. Um, it has a lot of product for this little wipe. Well, it's kind of big. But for this little wipe, it does a lot. You only need one of these. Like, this little thing does a lot. And it has a lot of product when you start to um, lather it on your skin. So, it comes with a lot of product. So, you just need one. Unless you wear a lot of makeup. But it smells great. Um, it feels great. I like the I like the exfoliating side. So it feels nice on the skin. Um, it's a great exfoliator. And I won't say that it's gentle because 
Okay, it's gentle when you put it on your skin at the moment, but afterwards, after you rinse off that product off, yeah, it does not leave a gentle feeling. And you only need one pad. Um, so those are the pros about this product, but it leaves my skin very rough and dry and itchy. And I don't know if I will repurchase this product again because... I mean, I just don't, like, I just don't know. Like, I'm in between. Um, I will rate this product from a 1 to 10. I'll give it a 5. Um, 1, because the itchy feeling, it makes my skin rough. It gives me hyperpigmentation. I'm wearing makeup, so that's what you can't see it. So, I had to find a foundation that is a little bit dewy, so my skin won't look dry. And my skin has been peeling and ashy looking. And I do not like that feeling. I don't know if I need a stronger moisturizer after I use this. P probably I need to do that. But yeah, so I will probably come back and give you guys an update um, an update um, review on this product. So I can control the ashiness and the rough and the hyperpigmentation. Because this is not cutting it. Like... No. Mm -mm. No. So, yeah. Will I repurchase this? Maybe not. Maybe not. No. So, you guys, this is my review on the Aveeno Cleansing Pads. Um, so, I hope you guys enjoy it. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.